Hey everyone, so I was editing this video and I'm, I'm like destroyed right now, but I couldn't connect to Battlefield 1 servers, so just deal with Battlefield 5 gameplay. Hello everyone, I'm Pacific Cash Gamer and welcome back to another video. And in this one I want to talk about Battlefield 1 being the king of sniping in Battlefield as a series, okay? So I started playing Battlefield with Battlefield Bad Company or it was either Battlefield 4. I bought like Battlefield 4 and then I bought Bad Company or I bought Bad Company and Battlefield 4. Whichever one of those came first that I bought, okay? And I played Battlefield 1. I loved that game. That game was so much fun. And Battlefield 5. And I can tell you that Battlefield 1 has the best sniping, okay? Now just first of all, right off the bat, I wish there was sniper. I wish there was weapon attachment. Not just sniper attachments, but weapon attachments in Battlefield 1, okay? Because like it would do great if you could... Do something other than change the magnification of your sniper rifle or the fire rate for the damage drop off, okay? I wish there was more to it. I liked a lot of the snipers, you know, even though pretty much every sniper rifle in that game held five rounds, they all kind of felt different. I mean, there was definitely the good ones and the bad ones, but the snipers really felt, a lot of them felt to me different. You know, you could use something like the Gewehr 98, like even the Gewehr 98 and the Gewehr 95. They felt way different. What I also really liked was that sweet spot in sniping. How, okay, you could pick the fastest fire rate snipers, they don't have a sweet spot. But the ones like that have the, the bolt back and it really takes a lot of skill to snipe with, they have that sweet spot where, you know, you don't have to necessarily hit a headshot and you get higher damage, right? I thought that was a brilliant idea. I loved that idea. I think it made sniping... Just a tad bit easier, especially if you knew what you were doing. But, you know what? I don't care. I thought it was fun. It made it so sniping was not as scary, alright? Because sniping, whether you're playing Battlefield 4, Battlefield 5, alright? Bad Company, is all about getting that headshot. And, you know, sniping, I think, was definitely way more difficult in Battlefield 4 and Battlefield 5. Battlefield 4 and 5, you level up sniping so slow. Alright, even Bad Company 1. But in Battlefield 1, it was that much easier to level up sniping because iron sight sniping was a thing and was balanced pretty good in Battlefield 1. It wasn't like, okay, you have a sniper and you have iron sights, you're gonna one-shot everything. It didn't change, like, the zeroing, or not the zeroing, the sweet spot distance of the sniper rifles. And can I just say, Battlefield 1, when you got a headshot, that sound, the sound effect, like that's one of the things of Battlefield 1 that I will remember from that game is the freaking sound of hitting a headshot. It was so satisfying to play a sniper and hit that headshot and just hear it. Just, it was amazing. All right, now spawning flare was okay, but the main thing with Battlefield 1 was that sniping was just awesome, all right? Now, I don't like that in the classes, there's different pistols that are not consistent with each class. But I can tell you the Mars Automatic as a handgun was really fun to use because it didn't feel quite like a DMR, but it definitely was like a hand cannon, okay? It was a freaking gu it was a gun. Like, you had your handguns, then you had the handgun. It was very fun to use, I like how balanced it was. And definitely as a sniper, when you were stuck to your pistol, you definitely felt like you had a chance. You didn't have a good chance, but you had a chance. And, you know, the, the cable bullet thing was pretty cool. I like that as a sniper, you could pick up the cable bullets and use them to snipe against... I mean, you could use them to snipe against tanks, that was fine. But snipe against, like, the armored classes, that was pretty dope. So... You know, as a sniper, it wasn't just, all right, you're sniping people. It's like, okay, you see an armored class, do you have the cable? It's, yes, you can go off out on the armored class guy. So, overall, I think sniping was just, it was a lot of fun because it was more than just put the spawn beacon down and shoot, right? Honestly, sniping was viable. Normal sniping was viable. It was very satisfying to snipe. It wasn't just a headshot game with every single weapon. And, you know what? I kind of miss that. I miss that a lot, you know? Battlefield 1, they kind of have that weird DMR system with the DMR, or Battlefield 5, sorry, has the bolt actions and the DMRs and they do different things, you know. I feel like the specialization of Battlefield 1, you know, you could pick uh, 
depending on your weapon, how specialized you were in Battlefield 1. I think that that is gone from Battlefield 5 a little bit, but I don't know. We'll see. Let me know what you think about it in the comments below. Did you do a lot of sniping in Battlefield 1? Did you have a lot of fun with it? I know I did. I had so much fun sniping in Battlefield 1. But that's really it for this video, guys. If you enjoyed, you can tell me in the comments below. Subscribe if you're new for more videos on Battlefield. I'm Pacific the Casual Gamer. I suck just as bad as you do at video games. And I'll see you next episode, stream, vlog, or Instagram post of whatever I decide to make.